Hello. We will now learn how to install C++. Here is a quick view of what we will be doing in this session. I am working on the Windows OS, and I will be using Dev C++ IDE to write the C++ programs. If you are using Linux or Mac OS, you can install any of the popular IDEs like CodeBlocks, CodeLite, Qt Creator, or Eclipse CDT. So let's install Dev C++. Just follow these steps. It's a very simple process. As the first step, type Dev C++ Download into the search bar of any browser or any search engine, like Google or Microsoft Bing. From the results that you get, click download link of the website named sourceforge.net. We are now at sourceforge.net portal from where you can download Dev C++. Click the download button. A setup file gets downloaded. It is a file with .exe extension. You can either open the setup file right away, or save it using the save as option for later use. When you open or execute the setup or .exe file, it starts downloading Dev C++ IDE software onto your computer. After the IDE is downloaded, installation process starts automatically. You are asked to choose your language. Select language from the drop-down list. I have selected English. On the license agreement pop-up, click I agree button. On choose components pop-up, click the next button. Next, you can choose the install location. Click install button, and dev C++ files will be installed in the default destination folder at c colon backslash program files backslash dev cpp. However, if you want to install C++ in another drive or folder, click browse. The browse for folder pop-up appears. I want to install C++ in the F drive, and so I double click on local disk F. In the local disk F, I want to install C++ at the root location, and so I click the OK button. Now click the Install button. The installation proceeds. Click Finish button. The installation process is complete. Go to your desktop. A shortcut icon appears. From desktop, double-click the Dev C++ shortcut icon to launch C++. You can also launch C++ by running the executable file from the folder where Dev C++ is installed. I have it installed at f colon backslash dev hyphen cpp, and so, I go to f drive, and then I open the Dev cpp folder. Let's double-click the devcpp.exe file to launch C++ IDE. We are now in the C++ editor window. Dev C++ has been launched successfully. Wasn't the installation quite easy? In the next session, we will take a sneak peek of the IDE and will write our first C++ program. Until then, have a nice time. Take care.